welcome back to Danny's Math Sub, where today we are still in the supermarket, but this time I'm going to look at a few electrical items because the store has a current offer on for me. They are doing offers where I can simply pay a deposit and then pay the rest off in instalments. Now, before I go through and explain what that means, don't forget that subscribe button if you're enjoying the videos or if you're learning from the videos. Now, what does it mean if a supermarket is offering me this deal? Well, what it means is a deposit would be some money I pay today. It'd be some money I pay towards the item, but not all the money. I would then spread the cost of the rest of the money over a certain period of months. Those payments would all be the same and they'd equal the total amount of all the items. It just saves me paying all that money up front straight away. For instance, if I wanted to buy these three things, a large speaker, earphones and a small speaker, well, if I know all their prices, I can add them up. And if you're not too sure how to do that, please go back and look at my video yesterday. But these all come to a total of £200. But the shop are doing this new offer, where you can pay just £50 a day and take all these items home. I can then pay the rest of the money over five months. Well, how much would I be paying each month? Well, we start off by taking the £50 off the total, because that's the money I'm paying today. I would then follow that up with five equal payments. So I'd need to take my £150 and share it equally between five months. That would give me a total of £30 each month. So if I wanted these three items, I could pay £50 a day and £30 a month over the next five months. Let's have a look at another offer they've got on. I could buy a MacBook, iPad and earbuds for the following price. Well, if I add them all up, it gives me a total of £2,050. But this time the supermarket has two offers on. The first offer is that I could pay £1,000 today and then spread the rest of the cost over six months. Or I could just put £500 a day and spread the rest of the cost over 12 months. So which offer would offer the smallest amount of monthly payments? Well, we work it out the same way. We're just going to have to do it twice. Let's start off with the first deal. I'm going to take my £1,000 deposit off. That'd leave me £1,050 to spread over six months. Well, how do I do that? I'd simply divide the remaining amount by six, which means I'd be paying £175 a month. What about the other deal, though? Would I be able to get smaller repayments if I only paid £500 a day but spread my cost over a longer period of time? Well, let's have a look. Again, I'll take off the £500 that I'm going to pay today, leaving me £1,550. I would share that equally between 12, meaning that I'd be paying £129.17 a month. That would mean the second offer gives me lower repayments every month, but it would mean I'll be paying that for a longer period of time. And then one last offer. They have a whole bundle here of PS4, two games and a charging port for my controllers. And I don't know what the total is, but they're offering me this deal. They're saying that I could pay just £200 now and 12 monthly instalments of £30. But how could I possibly work out how much that will cost them? Well, first of all, I'd like to work out how much I'm paying in my instalments. So 12 times 30. That tells me that over a year, I'll pay £360 in instalments. Plus the 200 I'm going to do today means that this bundle will cost me just £560. And that's it, ladies and gents. That's installments. That's simply when we put some money down today and we spread the rest of the cost over a given amount of time. The way we simply work this out is by taking that cost and dividing it by how many months or weeks or days we could be asked to pay it over. And it's that simple. Don't need to overcomplicate it. Simply divide the amount you need to pay over the given amount of time. I hope you've enjoyed this lesson. It's been quite a quick lesson. But as always, I have a worksheet attached for you to practice and you can contact me at any time if you require any help. Until the next video, stay safe and enjoy.